Why INTJs are considered weird. Introverted intuitive thinking judging types are often considered strange, but there is a reason for their strangeness. This video will explore the reasons why this personality type is labeled as weird, and advise on how they can be more understood by those around them. We live in an extrovert society, extroverts are typically seen as outgoing people who enjoy being the center of attention, so it's easy to see why introverts might be considered strange or weird, especially ones so particular as the INTJs. Like all introverts, INTJs spend time alone because they recharge their energy levels through solitary activities, like reading or writing, instead of interacting with others. Seeing that they have somewhat of a limited supply of it, it becomes easier to understand why they prefer to regulate their social interactions. Because if they don't, they'll simply end up drained, and that is not a sustainable way of living. 1. Questioning people's motives and intentions. INTJs are considered weird because they always question things, and people's motives slash intentions, INTJs never take anything at face value, and they never just accept things. They are also known for being very direct in their communication, which can come off as rude or cold, to people who aren't used to this type of communication style. These two traits combined set them apart from most people, because it makes them hard to understand and relate to. As a result, they are often misunderstood, overlooked, or undervalued in the workplace, because of their preference for spending time alone versus being around others. 2. Strong need for autonomy. Their need for autonomy is so strong, that sometimes it may seem like they don't care about others' feelings, even though this is not true at all. INTJs don't purposely set out to hurt or insult others, the way they operate is just different from most personality types. The INTJ's mind works in such a logical and analytical way, that their thought process can often come across as blunt and insensitive by other types, who do not understand where this approach comes from. Because of how rational they are, they're able to see things objectively, removing any emotional bias, which means what you get with them is unvarnished truth at its purest form. However, it doesn't mean they don't care about you when giving their opinion, they may be direct, but there's no malice behind it. If your feelings get hurt because you didn't like what you heard, just know they are trying to help. INTJs always consider other people's opinions, but at the same time, they want to make sure that their own values get through, and are respected. This can be a great quality when it comes to doing business, or speaking facts in general, however, it's also true that sometimes this trait can hurt someone else's feelings unintentionally. Their lack of willingness to sugarcoat and embellish their speech, is something that others also often consider as being weird. 3. INTJs do not follow the crowd. INTJ personality types do not like to follow the crowd, many people do not mind following along, but INTJs enjoy forging their own paths, and tend to be very independent. They want to know that they are doing something that makes sense for them personally, rather than just blindly following someone else's instructions or example without question. This trait has given them the image of being combative or difficult, but that's not the case at all. The reason why they question authority, is because they are painstakingly aware of the flaws in society, and they try to work towards solving these problems. They have a hard time with things that don't make sense or seem illogical to them. They want everything around them to be perfect, whether it's their work life, social circle, or environment, so when something seems off kilter for no explainable reason, there will likely be an INTJ giving you a side eye about it. This is why many people misunderstand this personality type since their quest for perfection can come across as being judgmental, even though that is almost never the case. INTJs are highly intelligent individuals, who are constantly strategizing how best to get where they need to go, without wasting energy on what they consider to be trivial matters. 4. INTJs aren't naturally expressive people. INTJs aren't naturally expressive people, so it's easy to comprehend why they might feel out of place in social situations, and why they might sometimes feel like misunderstood outcasts. They're not overly talkative, and aren't very demonstrative with their feelings, which makes them appear aloof, or even uninterested to many people who don't know how to read the subtle cues INTJs give off. They can be viewed as unfriendly because it takes time for them to warm up emotionally, but once you've earned their trust, your relationship will become incredibly fulfilling on both ends, something that's worth waiting patiently for. Despite being reserved in nature, the way INTJs express themselves is often through dry humor and sarcastic replies, this could potentially leave others feeling hurt if they are not aware of this. 
INTJs also tend to get very focused on a particular subject, and can spend hours at a time talking about it, which can be both intriguing or off-putting, depending on who they are speaking with. The way the world is set up doesn't work for everyone, so some people may find these traits difficult to understand. Understanding them does take effort though, but many INTJs feel others don't make enough of an attempt, although it's also true that INTJs do not make it easy either. Conclusion? INTJs are not naturally expressive people, which can make them seem weird to others, they don't follow the crowd and have a strong need for autonomy that is often misunderstood by those around them. However, this does not mean they're antisocial or unfriendly, it just means their personality type might be different than what's socially expected. It is important that we realize that even if someone appears weird on the outside, underneath their exterior might be a person looking for acceptance, just like anyone else would. If you liked the video, please consider leaving a like and subscribing, that will allow us to keep making more videos like this. For more related content please click on one of the suggested videos. Thank you for watching.